guys, it's Amy from Master Stretch, and today we're going to cover what might be causing your QL pain. And if you like this video, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel by clicking the link below. So let's talk about QL. The QL is this muscle that uh, often is lower back pain issues. Like so, when your QL is hurting, you would think you have you do have lower back issues, but it's the muscle does run more along. Uh, the mid to lower back. So it's going to run from the bottom of the ribs to the top of the pelvis and it's right off the vertebrae and it dips down and it's going to be right through here. So what causes that muscle to hurt? Um, some very common causes you probably don't even think of are everyday movements. Um, those are the things that usually cause issues. And so if you can correct these everyday movements, it will start to improve. Um, uh, the first and foremost is, is this, standing with your hip hiked out. So this is going to cause this, the, the, the action that the QL does is actually a hip lift. So anytime you're lifting this hip or this hip is hiked up, this is going to cause this muscle to become shortened and tight and it might start hurting. So this is a common cause of a QL pain. So notice if you're doing this and try to correct it. Maybe switch to this side. Um, so that's the first one. The second one would be um, if you are sitting and crossing your legs. So again, when you sit and cross your legs, this hip gets hiked up. Whichever leg is on top, this hip gets hiked up. And so that would be a cause of some QL pain. So be mindful if you're crossing your legs a lot, a lot and try not to do that. Um, another cause would be if you're sitting at the computer and you're leaning into your mouth side or leaning if you're driving uh, onto the armrest. So think about that leaning action that could be shortening and compressing that muscle and causing it to get tight and it's, then it'll start to hurt. So those are three, um, three big ones that could be causing your QL pain. Another one might be if you're twisting a little bit. So if you're in a position or in a job where you're twisting in the same act in the same movement a lot, that might be causing your back pain. Or if you're in a fixed position twisting. So I know a lot of people have two computer monitors and they twist to look towards one. Well if you do that often and a lot, then you might feel this QL act up as well. So those are uh, four common causes of the QL pain. Um, if you notice that you're doing any of those, try to correct it and it probably will fix your back pain. <laughs> um, and so if you like that, I also have a class that you might enjoy for the QL and I'll link to that at the end of the video. But um, until then, if you like this video, give me a like, give me a heart, leave a comment. I always appreciate that. And don't forget to subscribe to my free stretch program. You can link to it right here. And then also you'll see the links at the end of the video for the QL. So until next time, this is Amy from Mastery Stretch. Bye for now.